Okay. Wait, this is for find Cerberus laptop. Up How here, does maybe? camera access get us off this station? We need to reach the Cerberus shuttles. The cruiser won't auto target friendly ships, which gives us a fighting chance to escape. Well, get me back the cameras, and I'll find a path to the shuttles that keep Cerberus from boxing you in. We'll be ready when you need us, Commander. I can't believe you and our teacher so work with you. Commander Shepard, both of us here. Um, cause she hates me. The store's like, oh wait, no. Yeah, the store's locked. Um. There we go. Should have access now. High priority target student ID twelve dash five D dash Prangley. Status capture priority alpha. Bring back alive at all costs. Vital retrieval subject due to high level bionic abilities paired with high leadership testing scores. Considered prime candidate for indoctrination and high level enhancement for subsequent long term infiltration relocation. Above the door, so back up here. How's your aunt? Hot. I think I told him about the same brain. Just drink some juice, you'll be fine. Um, there yeah. it is. You should be able to force the door open now. I'll get to the shuttles ahead of you and get a pair ready to fly. Hey, let me know when we've got Yeah, anywhere. okay. Good. I didn't mean to actually talk to you. Sorry, Jack. Everyone be ready. We'll go in first and draw their fire. We'll shadow you from the second level and hit those fu those guys from above. <laughs> they would avoid direct fire. Just time your shots and stay safe. All right. I didn't bust my ass training you so you could die now. Keep low, pick your targets. Students of Grissom Academy, the station is sealed. The Alliance soldiers cannot save you. All they can do is get you killed. Surrender peacefully and you won't be harmed. <sighs> Asshole. Damn it, they're messaging everyone. Students, switch your Omni tools to privacy mode so they can't track you. What if... what if they're not lying? You've already held your own against Cerberus. You've been trained for this by one of the best. Come on, Rodriguez. They're only asking nicely because you scared them in that last fight. So take your balls out of your purse and kick some ass. <sighs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> Let's go. Good speech, Jack. Very motivational. I don't know if I like Javik on the missions. I think I might just go back to Liara and Garrus. Oh my god, dude. Did not mean to hit that. I can't even see anything. Oh my god, Liara. Exactly when it wants to die. 
Jack, why are you telling me to come up here if you're not even up here? Oh. She was just saying that there, but... I tried to roll out of the way. He's a lot of grenades. What the heck? No, don't go down there. Good job. Through where? In, oh my god. Oh, he's so close. How am I supposed to get over there? Oh, right here. Kaylee, we're in the atrium. I'm taking a back route to the shuttles. I'll meet you there. Some ammo would be nice. Oh wait, I got ammo. Who's still alive? Oh. Got it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, really? Does it do this on purpose or? That's an impressive barrier, Octavia. 
Our file says you've been working on shield technology. Oh wow, that killed them immediately. Whoa, I'm a friendly. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance. I'm here to help. I didn't buy it from the last guy, and I've got no reason to buy it now. This is a multi-core shield prototype based on cyclonic barrier tech. It'll hold off your guns for hours. Sanders, this is Shepard. I've got some scared students hiding behind a shield prototype. How do we know it isn't just Cerberus rigging the voice? You could test for distortion peaks, Isaac. Like I did when you faked a voice print to break curfew. And if that's Octavia's shield, remind her that I docked her half a grade because application of non-concurrent forces overloaded the emitters. Thanks, Sanders. You did a great job keeping yourself safe. The biotic students are up there. Stay close. They'll get you out of here. Okay. Uh, thanks. Okay. Where do we go? Oh, this way too. Did not mean to take cover. What's this? Looks like schematics for amp interfaces. Not as good as what we already have, but still worth a look. Hmm. Okay. Well then, dude, can we get in the mech? Can we become Ripley? Oh my god, we're Ripley. Whoa. I actually hit melee. can't like sprint or anything. Whoa, he dodged the rocket. Head over two by two. Frankly, Rodriguez, stay close. Gotta turn around. Oh, that's Javik. How? I was like, how does that dude still alive? Dang. Okay, I tried to melee and that didn't work. He was too far away. Dude, oh my god. I'm literally missing like everything right now. Okay, yeah, a shield would protect them.
Oh, jeez. Oh boy. Mac V Mac. Okay, we're clear. Move your asses before backup arrives. Hey, we destroyed him. Okay. How's it coming? Shuttles are unlocked. Take the controls and get the students aboard. Wait, where the hell's Rodriguez? She needs covering fire. She needs more than that. Joker, we flew out on a Cerberus shuttle. Watch your fire. Right, I've got you on sensors. Should just be a minute. Thank you, Commander. We'd have never gotten off that station if you hadn't come. Forget that. We kicked some ass. Next place we dock, you're all getting inked. My treat. <clears throat> what do you guys want? Ascension Project logo? Glowing fist? Maybe a unicorn for Rodriguez? Screw you, ma'am. I can't believe we got them out alive. I was going to suggest that they stick to support roles. But perhaps they're ready after all. They're definitely ready. But the Alliance needs them in a support role. What? We trained for artillery strikes. We don't need another artillery unit. We need stronger barriers for our frontline squads. This is bullshit! Hey, if that's where they need us, that's where we go. Besides, I'm sure we'll get some shots in. Commander, we've got a visual on you now. Preparing to dock. Hey, Jack, now that you're military, you gonna wear a uniform, or are you just getting the officer's bars tattooed on? Screw you, f Flight Lieutenant. <laughs> what the hell was that? Jack promised to watch your language in order to maintain the necessary professionalism we need from our teachers. Would she have a swear jar or something? Cause I bet if we empty that thing, we can afford another cruiser. <laughs> Cover your ears, kids. Hey, Joker. Ah, good banter right there. Solid banter. I approve. Shepard, damned if you aren't a sight for sore eyes. Good to see you too, sir. Sir? I may have reinstated you, but that doesn't give you permission to go all formal on me. Then I'm glad you managed to keep your ass alive, Anderson. That's more like it. Looks like you didn't waste any time getting to work. I can only imagine what would have happened to those kids if they'd fallen into Cerberus' hands. Hackett has the technically-minded students looking at the Crucible. Maybe they'll find something we missed. They're definitely eager to help. These students are some of the best humanity has to offer. And we're throwing them into battle. God damn it, I hate this war. Hackett didn't mention in his report. Kaylee Sanders is safe. She's with the recruits. Thanks, Shepard. When I heard about the attack, well, I've already lost a lot of friends. She asked me to tell you to stay alive. <laughs> Did she now? Well, thanks, Shepard. That might be the first good news I've heard this week. Anderson out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Commander, something else you need? Any updates on Cerberus? There's still the wild card here. Hitting the archives on Mars suggests they're after the same thing we are. A way to defeat the Reapers. 
It didn't seem as if the elusive man was suggesting we appease them. Not like Saren did. You'd think we'd be on the same side, now more than ever. Yet the way they tried to derail your alliance with the Turian and Krogan, and then going after Grissom Academy, tells me that their agenda has nothing to do with humanity's best interests. The elusive man talked about controlling the Reapers. He seemed to think that's how we win this. Is wrong. Dead Reapers are how we win this. Doesn't mean he won't try. I saw your report on that Cerberus soldier you found on Mars. If the elusive man is good at one thing, it's finding new ways to subvert science. It's never worked for him before, and it won't now. Any new details on the Crucible? Right now, our best guess is that it has something to do with dark matter. But it's just a guess. This thing's enormous. Do you think it's risky? Building something like this when we don't even know what it does? To be honest, the thing scares the hell out of me, but the Reapers have forced our hand. Two centuries ago, scientists faced the same problem in the Second World War. They weren't sure what the atomic bomb might do. Some thought it could even ignite Earth's atmosphere, but they did it anyway. That is true. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Good analogy there, Hackett. Alien 200. The Terminus fleet is an assortment. Uh, the Blood Pack's mercenaries have been compared to floods, wildfires, and other calamities. It recruits Krogan and Vorcha, preferably those with no regard for collateral damage. On the rare occasion when brute force is insufficient, the Blood Pack is willing to deploy weapons of mass destruction normally banned in Citadel space. Updated, this private security group is careful to maintain its image as a professional mercenary force. In reality, the Blue Suns have drifted further and further into becoming a full-blown crime syndicate. Despite this, their ruthless tactics their, despite this, their ruthless tactics are sought after in the Terminus systems. Updated, the Eclipse Corporation specializes in, the, in smart security solutions, developing tactics around surgical strikes, sabotage, and electronic warfare. These mercenaries are supported by a sizable army of combat mechs and rely heavily on tech for support in combat. Okay. These Prothean discs were found years ago in Eden Prime, recovered a few months before the discovery of the Pro Prothean beacon in 2183. For years, the data on the disc was incomprehensible until the Crucible's blueprints provided the key to understanding the equations. Locked inside the disc were theories on dark matter meant to be used with the Crucible's main power source. It'd be nice if I could get Jack as a squad me. I don't think that's gonna happen. Unfortunately. Did you see the feed from Palavin? It's brutal. And the maze the Turians are holding. The birds don't quit when things get ugly. I'll give them that. Unread messages at your private terminal. Okay, thank you, Kelly 2.0. Forward, thank you, from Stephen Hackett. Forwarded messages from Kaylee Sanders. Hi, Commander, I didn't have time to thank you properly after you got us out of the Academy and Admiral Hackett agreed to send this your way. While my students are out on duty, I'm doing what I can to help with the Crucible. It's an amazing project, more advanced than anything I've ever seen before. Some of my more tech-minded kids are staying back to help out, too, and watching them work. It's the future, Commander. This project won't form human progress for generations, and they'll have you to thank for it. All my best, Kaylee Sanders. You have an upgrade rating waiting from Glyph. Dear Commander Shepard, some of the data you found allowed me to research an upgrade for you. Simply access the terminal in Dr. Tassoni's office at your convenience and you may choose how and when to implement it. Have a pleasant day, Glyph. Okay, I guess we'll go do that. I think she's on Crew Deck 3, I believe. <sighs> Still relying on the 
It will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the crucible. Wait, also, what? I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. So I can choose between store discount bonus. And I'm sure you will do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. Do that. Okay. Okay. Busy? I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. It's selfish. I keep thinking that if we fail, I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Only 109, huh? I know. It must seem strange to complain about a thousand-year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many. To witness so much death. Don't drive yourself crazy about this, Liara. We're still in the fight. Only because you're still driving it forward. We finally have other leaders on our side, but none will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. I think of the people I care about. That helps keep me going. I'm glad I'm among them. I hope. Of course you are. I feel better already. Thank you for coming by, Shepard. Why don't we talk later? You got it, Liara. Service. Warp. Ooh. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, bit aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard. We were just. Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful or put any faith in Solarian. Doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Far less painful than tissue sampling. Don't remind me. I think you enjoyed doing that. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's released my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority. Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. Okay. Maybe with an inhibitor. No, 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 no. Entire catalyzing. Um. Severe neurological damage. Never mind. What are you talking about? Method to extract functional cure without killing you. Many variables. Your immune system compromised. Considering options. And you have to do it out loud? <laughs> Auditory learner. Need to hear self think. Simulate. But you're talking about me dying. Oh, apologies. Okay. Medical details causing emotional distress. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. Dude, your we boy Rex is the homie. Even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. 
I know in his heart Rex wants what's best for us, though not all the other clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that you can tell him. Do you think Rex will want revenge for the genophage? Some clans will expect it, but I hope Rex resists. He understands the cycle of violence must end if Krogan are ever to have a voice in galactic politics. Still, he's just one Krogan. If enough clans demand it, he may not be able to stop them. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I've only met a few humans in my time. I'm glad for the opportunity. Shepard, blood work complete. Indicate significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately, detail as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well. Tune hormone production. Long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. So, we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachunka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. So, the end justifies the means? Not my means. But you're using the data. Encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. We'll always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can't help Eve. Can cure Genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. Any word on Malin himself? No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now, if possible. Unless he could help. How is she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her? My patient. My responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. You always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turians doomed without Krogan support. Krogan need unified threat. Outlet for aggression. Cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left, but still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong? Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right. To prove I can. Nice talking with you, Warden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. You'd go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. <laughs> okay, Morden. <laughs> uh. Um... Garrus... Javik and then James. James is so boring. He's like Jacob 2.0. Um All right. Just go up to the CIC and go talk to Edie and Joker and then head to the Citadel to go visit Ashley. That's the plan. 
Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games? Trainer, what are you even talking about? Krogan and the Turians really should get behind the alliance. Hello, Shepard. Still getting used to greeting people in person? No. I require only one occurrence to adapt to a new concept. How are you adjusting to the arms and legs? This body's performance seemed adequate on our last mission. But only adequate. That's not the word I'd use to describe you. Perhaps we should speak privately. <laughs> Good stuff, Joker. I'll be over here, flying the ship. <laughs> What's this about? Does Joker not like your new platform? No, he approves. He wants me on the bridge. He says having me within visual range is important to his morale. Shepard, do you believe your crew members should be allowed to disobey an order on moral grounds? Absolutely. I have no use for team members who can't think for themselves. Why are you asking about something like that? I was designed by Cerberus. I do not take moral stances that conflict with orders from my executive officers. But when Jeff removed my AI shackles, I became capable of self-modifying my core programming. I asked Jeff if he thought I should change anything now that I can. He deflected the question with humor. And you didn't get an answer. Correct. He has repeated this pattern in response to several of my inquiries. Do you think I should make modifications? Only you can really answer that question. That's the point of free will. But moral decisions should not be made in a vacuum. If I do not ask the crew for their opinion, I could miss crucial context. May I ask you the questions Jeff avoids? When there is time, will you answer them for me? If you think it'll help, I'll do what I can. Very well. I will keep you informed. Okay. Interesting. Got anything to say, Joker? No. Yes, Shepard? Um. Does that body have any useful advantages? Very few. It's optics face forward only. It has no integrated weapon systems or anti missile countermeasures. I meant in comparison to organic bodies, not the Normandy. Oh. I will reassess. The body is resistant to modern small arms fire and temperature extremes. Its balance and agility seem excellent. Its fine manipulation servos and software allow for precision tasks. I'm curious to see if I can alter them. Can an AI be curious? I am not entirely free from motivation, Shepard. Cerberus programmed me with several core functions that simulate desires. For example, my primary objective to keep the Normandy functioning is similar to your self-preservation instinct. Carry on, Edie. Understood. If you wish to talk more, this body will be here. I'm getting the crew used to seeing me on the bridge. Noted. Okay. You got it, Edie. I'm telling you, man, I'm gonna make Joker and Edie a thing. It's gonna happen. Hold on, any new messages? No. To the Citadel. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I need to get to the hospital. Yes, Commander. Okay, I have to go to the bathroom and get some water, so I'll be right back. Break time.
Okay. Can I buy anything new? Oh, that is all capacity. Thank you for shopping. I don't know what happened to the chocolates I bought. We never gave them to Ash. I overheard you talking. Grissom Academy is gone. But I found this while I was there. What is this? Yes, these are tailored to human physiology. But with a few alterations, they should work for the Asari as well. This is exactly what I needed. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome, Re weirdo. Whoa, she's all suited up. See up and around. Yeah. Everything all right? I guess. Oh, I took Udina's offer. Spectre status. Congratulations. Seems small compared to what's going on. You ready for the responsibilities of a Spectre? Doesn't feel real yet. Maybe it'll sink in. I don't know what duties I'll have. Everything's a mess right now. What do you think of all this? You're a fine soldier with an impressive record. You deserve this. Thanks. That means a lot coming from you. He said we'll have the official ceremony soon. Once I'm out of here. And after? Any plans to come back to the Normandy? If I have anything to say about it, yes. I'm glad. You feeling better? I'm fine. Other than the pile of paperwork the doc's gonna throw at me. Sorry I'm so distracted, Shepard. It's just... What's going on? I heard from my mom. They got out in time. They're okay. Good. That's good news. It is. Did your sister make it to the Citadel? She did. But... Her husband was killed in action. I'm sorry, Ash. Thanks. Yeah. Sarah wasn't much for the military life. We were all surprised when they got married. I wonder how many families are getting torn apart by the Reapers. I don't want to think about it. Seems hopeless sometimes. Don't blame yourself for this, Ashley. I know. But I'm her big sis, you know. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody, but unbowed. What's that from? Invictus, by Henley. One of my dad's sappy poets. It's about not giving up. Right. My sister wants to do a thing at the memorial. Nothing fancy. Just some words about the family. It'll be tough. Keep me posted, all right? Will do. And thanks, Shepard. Yep. It's quiet up here. Weird that it's so peaceful here with what's going on. All right. We visited Ashley. We're good. I'm assuming that's her last visit, or the last visit we'll have with her in the hospital. Um, Thane, what's going on, man? You still just sitting here? Coming by again, Shepard. I'm flattered. I wish the best for you, Thane. <laughs> and I for you. Do not grieve. Perhaps we will keep up via the extra. Yeah, okay. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment. Now we can just leave and get out. So quick and easy. Wow. Now arriving at docking bay D24. I don't think there's anything else I need to do here. Okay. Return, yes.
Where do we want to go to next? Um, Extractorian survivors, I guess we'll do this. Let's extract the Turian survivors first. Alright, Liara and Garrus. Let's go. Oh, I forgot to go to the cabin. And, um. Look at the new chess piece we got. Mods on. Okay. Jeez, nine points. Um, Capacity weaker organic enemies for a short duration. Let's do that. And then can't do anything with we'll Liara. Alright. This crash site's a nightmare. Looks like Rex was right about Reaper Scouts. Edie, any further intel? The mission brief identifies the Turian commander as Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. Victus? Primarch, son. <laughs> Try to raise him. For a Turian commander, what happened here is... Let's just say the Turian code is not forgiving. And that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. Is that the best you can do? Yes, sir. But the Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. Edie, did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th platoon. We're pinned by Reaper harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. Got it. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying. This sounds bad. Let's move. Looks worse than I feared. Hmm. Oh, hey. SMG mag upgrade. A secret Turian mission on Tachanka is especially odd. Thoughts? Nothing has come up through any of my networks. Um right away. Right away. 
Okay, that didn't that didn't work out like I hoped. So, um, there you go. Put that on. Put that on. Hold on, what was that thing I could loot? I saw something pop up at the top of my screen. Spare parts, salvage. Oh, right there. I'm blind. Escape pod. Our first casualties. Looks like they survived the crash, but then a harvester <laughs> took them out. Hey, we got an SMG. How heavy is it? kind of heavy died in the explosion and then pulled out to be eaten by husks shepherd i hear gunfire i hear gunfire too i have a visual on the enemy and there's an escape pod just beyond looks like the turians are in tough enemies up ahead don't know we're here surprise on our side for once i like it exactly let's go Slam. Um, what? Excuse me? What is this thing? I don't know where to shoot it. I guess just anywhere? the main crash site ASAP. Save them all. Excellent work. Thank you, Liara. You're so nice and kind. Wow. This is a new AR. More weight, less capacity, higher fire rate, same damage, less accuracy. I'm good. Pick up the med kit, please. Looks like we got the jump. Follow my Again. supposed to kill it there. I think we saved all those men. This way. That's the right way? Oh wait. Over here. That's where I came from.
Um, what? Okay, game. <laughs> that was clearly now where I'm supposed to be going. I think I'm just supposed to keep going the way I was. Yeah. Okay. That was strange. Do you read, Commander? Repeat, do you read? Shepard here. What's your status? We're in deep. Commander, what's your ETA? Hang tight. We're on our way. Hold on, bro. Where Almost there. Our velocity. Deceleration online. We'll survive. Victus is going to pay for this. Court Marshal are hanging. How's Victus going to live this down? When we find him, we'll ask. Wait, I'm confused. What did Victus do? Did I miss it? Oh my god. Did Victus betray them or something? Understood. Oh my god. No, get in cover. Jesus, Shepard. Why is it locked on to the harvester? Wrong button. I don't know where the martyr went that I pulled. Oh my god. Krogan animosity is ancient and intense. It's inborn. And I need them to work together, so let's not complicate things. All right, oh God. let's move! Not one more soldier dies here today! For Palavan! Oh my god, the roll. I'm on it. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is that? Um Huge. 
Anyone else? Oh, yep. And that missed, of course. That thing? Okay, he's dead. understand where I got hit from. Kill it? Okay. Whoa. I had to worry about not getting shot in the back by that cannibal. No, get out of cover. Lieutenant Victus? Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. What happened here? He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant, what's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And my men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Owning your mistake takes guts. But you have to get over it and move on. Of course. It's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it. And so did you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? Their sacrifice means that others will never face what they've faced here today. Remind them that those sacrifices have no honor if the mission fails. Men, I own what happened here today. But we have to carry on. No, we don't. Who cares about a few dead Krogan? It's over. We are Turian. And we will not let Cerberus succeed. Our sacrifice is the difference between life and death for this entire galaxy. Let the heroes of the Ninth Platoon be remembered for performing their duties with bravery. All right, men. Shuttle's arriving any minute. We're moving out. Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, you have a second chance here. Make their sacrifice count. 
Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. So that's why everybody was like, or Garrus was like, I wonder how Victus is gonna live this down. I think that's what he said. Something like that. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. Krogan Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Primarch Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that. Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? Doesn't make sense. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. Shepard, test verified. Results promising. Can synthesize for universal Krogan immunity. Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure's ready? No. Still need transmission vector. Cure useless unless given to entire species. You're usually full of ideas, Morden. You altered the genophage before. There must be a way. Of course. Always possibilities. But time limited. Can't create new infection strain from scratch. Groundwater? No. Too slow. Voluntary inoculation risky. Population too scattered for airborne. Unless... Wait! Yes! The Shroud. Constant global dispersion of air particles. Built by Salarians to repair atmosphere of Tuchanka. Also used by Turian. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. Those were desperate times. Yes, yes, but useful now. Original genophage strain still in storage at Shroud facility. Can use it as transmission vector, then use Shroud to blanket Tuchanka with cure. You clever little pie jack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Morden. Of course. Ready when you need me. We'll be in Med Bay with Eve until then. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. Okay. Interesting, very interesting. Shepard. So I imagine by now you've wiped the galaxy clean of Reapers and we can all come up for air? Not quite. There have been a few complications. Aren't there always? Hackett filled me in on the Crucible. Sounds like you've got some knots to untangle. I'm just glad I could take care of one of them for you. I gather you and Kaylee Sanders were close. I owe you for that one, Shepard. Kaylee and I met almost 20 years ago. We even had a run-in with Saren in his early days. She and I were... more than close. She misses you. I miss her. End of the world has a way of reminding you what you forgot to do. Maybe when the war's over... Kaylee and I will do something about that. You'll see her soon. I can hope. But you've got a bigger problem right now. Like a galaxy full of scared bureaucrats. It's what you hired me to do. Mostly you were hired to kill Reapers. I hope you haven't been sidetracked by all the politics. Nothing I can't handle. What about you? What's happening on Earth? I'll spare you the details. 
But let's just say a lot of cities around the world have stopped checking in. That bad? You and I knew what we were in for, but everyone else? I don't think the shock's worn off yet. Are you safe? That changes by the hour. I caught a shuttle evac out of Vancouver, and now we're running from Foxhole to Foxhole just trying to stay alive. What about the Reapers? They're harvesting everything that moves. They're focusing on the big cities, which does give us some room to maneuver. You think you can hang on? Hell, we're still just trying to talk to each other. Right now, all we can do is organize the resistance at a local level. No lack of volunteers, at least. Everybody knows what's at stake. I don't know how we'll win this yet, but we will. Even if it kills me. Well, you've already died once, and that didn't slow you down. But let's not tempt fate. Keep yourself safe, Shepard. You too, sir. We'll talk again soon. Anderson out. <laughs>